Hi, welcome to today's Talk of the Town. I'm Sandy Benson. Pop-Up Paints is a mobile interactive art studio that brings the paint party to you. Joining us now, artist and owner Emily Scott Pack explains how she uses her many talents to empower others through art and community. Welcome to the show. Thank you. Thank you so much for having me. So we'll talk a little bit about all the things that we have around here, but we'll start with when and how did you start your businesses? Um, I started originally in 2011 when we were stationed in Japan. My husband is active duty Marine Corps. Mm -hmm. And so when we moved there, I wanted to be able to have an activity for the community to do and have a way to teach art to others. So I started teaching art lessons and also doing the pop-up paints business. So what's your background? I went to art school. Um, I have a bachelor's of fine arts from Auburn University. And I also studied abroad at Glasgow School of Art in um, 2004. That's great. So yeah. where do you get your inspiration from to create some of the paintings that you teach and also that you sell? I, um, we moved here a year ago to the Low Country, and it's my first time to live in South Carolina and I'm just, I'm completely inspired by this place. I feel like I've never lived in a more inspirational place because of all it's of its beauty. It's awe-inspiring, Oh isn't my it? gosh, it's amazing. There's water surrounding you. Mm -hmm. I feel like that's really necessary for life in general. It makes you feel calm and at ease and, and all the beautiful things here. And to the people, they make you feel really good. All yeah. the people are so nice that's here. That's great. So let's talk a little bit about some of okay. the things that you have and then we'll talk about how pop-up art works because I think okay. it's a really clever okay. idea. Okay, great. Um, so what I traditionally do is I have a class or mm -hmm. I will have someone ask for a private class and then I do a theme painting based on whatever they ask for, like this low country crab. I originally created this for a bachelorette party. Oh. And so we had a group of um, 10 girls, and this is what she wanted to paint for everyone to take home to do something fun. I love it. So we all met and had um, drinks and food, and, and everyone painted the, um, the, the painting here, and it was a three-hour class. And we start step-by-step step from a drawing. You practice drawing it yourself, and then you draw it onto the canvas with charcoal. Right. And then I... I help you draw if you would like assistance and then we we go through the painting steps together that's I mean I love it and I so love it three hours later you have this masterpiece and you can yeah. take it home and, and hang then it they up. take it home hang it up and yeah. what a what a really nice memory especially yeah. for things like bachelorette party or you know birthday yeah. or anniversary or whatever exactly so yeah. talk a little bit about this this is a really unique piece thank you this is um, this is called encaustic painting mm -hmm. and um, this is actually a piece of encaustic photography um, so what does that mean encaustic so encaustic painting. is natural beeswax and you heat it to 100 60 degrees and it turns molten and then you can paint with it when it's in a liquid state. Wow. So you mix the natural beeswax, you mix it with um, resin, with Damar resin that's crystallized okay. and it all melts and then you add pigment to it. And so just think of like a crock pot and I have these huge paint brushes and a crock pot with liquid wax. It's, in, it, it's, it's really so Thank unique you. and it's a beautiful, Thank beautiful you. painting. I, I love this medium because you can touch and feel it. Yeah. It's really soft and um, it, it, I don't know, I feel like it's, it allows you to kind of come inside the painting a little bit because you get, it's hands on. You don't have to be scared of it or yeah. worry that you're going to mess it up. Yeah, and the color, I mean, you just add the colors to yeah, it? Yeah, so I use oil paint to pigment mine. Mm -hmm. um, I let the, the oil actually dry out of the paint, and then you're left with a lump of pigment, and then I mix it in with it. Wow. And so you can actually teach people to, yeah. uh, part, of, part of your classes, yeah. you could teach them how to do yeah. this. Yeah. I love it. I love it. So I know that you're um, doing this pop-up paint class. So talk a little bit about how that would work. So if you if you look at my website, then you can um, you can check my schedule and see if I have any classes that are okay. available for the public. I okay. do try to offer some occasionally about once a month. Um, I'm partnered with different restaurants and bars in, in Beaufort, where okay. I'm based out of, and I try to host one class a month at least. Okay. Um, and I've also just started doing um, pop-up paints with your pet. So you email me a picture of your pet, I sketch it onto the canvas for you, then you come in and we paint your pet together. Oh, that is so much fun. And really, anyone um, could could do something like this. I mean, with your with your assistance and exactly. your your teaching abilities. Exactly. They, they can probably produce one one of anything. Exactly. What I've never I've never had someone leave without a painting. They all do so much better than they think because it's 
it's an educational thing, but it allows you to really tap into that inner creative that most people don't know that they have. Yeah. And then they're so amazed and it's empowering. It At is. the end of the session, you're, you're completely confident and you're more empowered. So it's really about the experience. Emily, thank you. Thank really you. unique, really, really unique stuff. Thank and uh, we'll have all the information on the screen about how okay. people can contact you. So come back. Okay, I will. Thank okay. you. And we'll be right back with Talk of the Town.